Hello everyone, welcome back to our Total War Warhammer 3. I guess at this point it's basically a let's play, uh, but we're still working on the prologue. Uh, <laughs> I am kind of muddling through. Uh, I lost my volume here, so let's get that back. There we go. All right. So... Uh, we have some new quests to do, uh, which we we uh, did the Lucent Maze. Uh, we got the um, the Patriarch. We recruited Sergei Yakov, uh, which is pretty cool. And now we have the Trial of the Fervent, uh, which is to uh, successfully use our Patriarch's wound ability on an enemy hero. Um, and we get Saint Anushka's finger bone from doing that. Uh, so that'll be pretty cool. Uh, but right now, we actually have some uh, ability points or skill points to put in. Uh, I was looking over these a little bit, and I think that I want to take um, for Yuri, uh, I think I'm going to up our armor uh, and then we can get Killing Blow, which seems pretty cool. It's an active ability, uh, so we have we do have to select it, but it lasts for 30 seconds, a 90 second cooldown, uh, and I think that that will be pretty cool to try out. And if we hate it, then maybe we can refund them. I don't know how, how long you can wait before refunding, or if you can just do it at any time. Uh, but we'll find out, because we're going to do that. For Zoria... Let's go ahead and give her... Uh, let's do a little more income. I, I definitely want that. Um, and then I like uh, this spell, Death Frost. Now, it does say, I believe, single target. But even so, cast on a, a lord. Uh, we could focus fire down a lord or a hero. Uh, that would be clutch. So that's what we're going to do there. And then Sergei, we don't have anything for him. His voice cracks me up. <laughs> Patriarch! Uh, it's fantastic. Uh, Alright, so we got that done. Now we're going to have Yuri. Uh, we can't have him move just yet. I'm not going to do any upgrades yet. Not going to do any upgrades. Um, right now we're just going to we're going to let a turn go by. And now, now we can uh, do a little bit more. So Sergey, uh, want you to join there, and we re replenish uh, our troops by eight percent, which is fantastic. I think we were already at a hundred, but that or no, no, we weren't. So, uh, so that helped a lot. Uh, now, though, we can recruit. Um, so, we don't have any war sleds anymore, uh, so we definitely want to get those. Um, we, I believe, are also out of uh, the dervishes, so we'll get, I think, two of those. And then uh, the streltsy, I'm, those are, that's a hybrid unit. Uh, so they're decent melee combatant. They're armored. They have armor piercing. So they're guns and great axes. Uh, and I think that that will be uh, pretty clutch. Uh, so I, yeah, I think I'm going to get two Streltsy units. Actually, let's do three. Uh, let's do three. Uh, and I, Oh. Oh, I can I can queue them up to be recruited uh, each turn. Okay, okay, and then I just have to click on them to remove them. Very cool. Did not know that. That's dope. Okay, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Uh, so two turns worth of uh, recruitment happening. Uh, so again, we're not really going to do anything with Ice Canyon. Uh, it's it's pretty far away uh, from everyone else, and I like there's not really a point. I don't I don't think. Well, I mean, Kislev Refuge is even further 
Uh, I don't know if that matters in the long run. I would imagine that it does, but I'm not going to... Uh, ooh, be on objectives panel. Oh, oh. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll get... Uh, find Ursa to win the campaign. No. We already did this once before, didn't we? <laughs> didn't we look at this before? I think so. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. Um, so we've got one turn until our uh, field medicine is unlocked. That's cool. Um, again, we're not worrying about Ice Canyon. Okay, we got our technology, field medicine, researched. Uh, so that means that we can start a new technology. Um, and I think... Hmm. Stern Discipline gives us better leadership, and that uh, can give us more, uh, or, or minus 5% on upkeep for infantry units, and that leads to, you know, some other kind of cool stuff. Uh, but surviving, the surviving tab uh, could be another but like I mean, we're at the struggling uh one for now i think uh so let's go with bartering we'll we'll increase our income and then we can he maybe do some other stuff uh okay so we got claw reach over here all right so we could go southeast uh and take out claw reach um so our objectives uh, trial of the Adaman. It's just upgrade a settlement to tier 5. Trial of the Magic Wielder. Target an enemy settlement army or hero with one of your Ice Maiden's abilities. Uh, I thought that we did that, but apparently not. Uh, battle for the Brazen Altar. I have no idea what battle that will be. Uh, and then Trial of the Fervent, which is use your Patriarch's Wound ability on an enemy hero. Okay. So we got to focus on one of these uh, to to do right now. Um, so turn enemy settlement army or here. Okay, so that's so this is uh, this can be used on the world map. It looks like that's kind of neat. Okay, um, can it? Oh, I forgot. We have new ancillaries, so we can. Uh, she can have the camp quartermaster. Uh, and then she can actually take the cartographer. And that'll put the toll keeper with Yuri. Excellent. Excellent. Very cool. Um, and this is all assigned already. Son of oh, wait. Um, do I have to... his mount? Okay. Oh, it says none. Um, but I want my warhorse. <laughs> so, it doesn't show me my warhorse. That's a little sad. But that's okay. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. Uh, I guess we'll just uh, enter the lands of Corn, the Blood God, conquer them, and raid his shrine. Okay. So, that's the... Ungold blood. Uh, I think we're just going to go this There's way. No time to rest. And then we're just going to resolve that. And we're going to move him. Alright, so we are headed into enemy territory. We're going to go towards Gore Town. Uh, which we don't know anything about yet. View a settlement's garrison. Press this button. Uh, garrison units provide defense. While a settlement is under siege, upgrade a settlement's main building to improve the strength of its garrison. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, so we can't see the garrison details of Gore Town yet. Uh, that makes sense. We're still pretty far away. Also, I want to try this. Uh, the Pan to Lord command is, for me, is still set to home which uh, I'm using a 60% keyboard, so I don't even know where the home button is on this. 
Um, and for and my uh, encoder still says that it's overloaded, but I'm going to ignore it because I think that it's fine. <laughs> so I don't know what the deal is. I don't know why I keep saying that the encoder is overloaded, uh, but going. we're gonna we're gonna just go with it. Tribes hear of my exploits. A Kislevite who subjugates demons and emerges from Cinch's labyrinth. Where before they would have ridden out to crush us. Now they send an envoy and some piffling tribute to try and buy my allegiance. Gerrit urges caution, as usual. But I could turn this to my advantage. Dominate these lands, not just with war, but with words. Through such base diplomacy, I can further my quest to find Orson. All I need to do is accept their gift. Okay. Um, I think instead of gaining a powerful item and no diplomatic bonus, I'm going to trade for it uh, to gain a diplomatic bonus and leave us less obligated. So we got the potion of strength, base weapon damage plus 50%. Armor piercing weapon damage plus 50%. Uh, duration 33 seconds. Cooldown 60 seconds. Very cool. Diplomatic bonus with the Norskins. Hover your cursor over it to view the specifics. Okay. <clears throat> now take diplomatic actions with factions you are not at war with. Actions with factions. So Norska list displays the faction you've encountered so far. Uh, world leader appears here. Higher the attitude, the more likely it is they will accept your offer. And press this button to start diplomacy with a selected leader. Once you're done, press this button to exit. Cool, cool. Tribal uh, fury. I will well, let's, just, let's just take a look. I see power in you. Okay, so I'm assuming that this like minus seven, minus ten, minus sixty-six means that they don't like that deal, maybe? Um let's just see. Military alliance. Let's just see. Uh yeah, okay. So uh, this is their opinion of the deal. Wow. <laughs> they don't like that at all. Uh they do not care for it. Um Offer or demand payments. Offering payments makes deals more attractive. If you offer payment and ask nothing in return, there will be a diplomatic relations bonus. We could join war against someone, and we could declare war upon them. Uh, right now, I think we're just going to uh, you know, keep it, keep it simple. Oh, uh, make a military alliance with a faction. Dang it. <laughs> Uh, there's more than one way to bring a tribe to heal. Find common cause with them, for only together will you survive. And it unlocks the heavy bear war sleds. Ugh. So we're going to have to make an alliance with someone. Uh, but Can for we now, don't submit to us. I think we'll be okay. You already know the answer, Garrick. We go to war. We go to war. Uh, trial of the Warmonger. Win three battles. Some will never kneel. The only answer is to obliterate them utterly. Wipe out your foe. It matters not who, for this is a trial of war itself. The consequences be damned. It is called total war, after all. <laughs> uh, so this dude, I wonder... Uh, he is a... That doesn't say. I'm not sure what... Oh, he's the tier one unit tier 2. Okay, so it's tier 1 and tier 2. Marauders and Norse controls. Uh, and I guess this guy is their, their leader. Maybe? Uh, I don't know. I wish there was a way to like permanently say, no, we're, we're, we're not gonna... <sighs> Man, okay. It does generate quite a bit more income and growth. Uh, and it provides garrison for 3200 all right we'll do it we'll do it uh because we do need to upgrade a settlement to um level five but ice canyon we're not worrying about okay 
Okay. We've got 18 out of 20 units, uh, I think, as long as they are loyal. that we could do. We can do two more. Yeah, and that's it. And then we're we're done recruiting units for now. We have our 20. Uh, and then we can end the turn. Okay. Grawl Foe Splitter is coming at us. Ooh, we got a, an achievement. Neat. Okay, so Grawl Foe Splitter is, uh, is going around that way. So he is an enemy. But this guy is neutral. Oh, he's part of the, the Norska. Okay. Okay. Interesting. I wonder if he would uh, join me in war against... Um, so they are the Kvelegs. Bring death. I wonder if... Uh, oh, he does not care for me. Um, <laughs> uh, they condemn trespass against the Kvelegs. Oh. No, Sorry, listen. buddy. I see power in you. Uh, okay. So I, I propose that you join war uh, with me against the Blood Keepers. He does not like that. Uh, I will pay you uh, one gold. <laughs> no, uh, I'll pay you 1,000 gold. Mm, still doesn't like it. How about 2,000 gold? Nope. Yeah, I don't think... I don't think he's going to join us. I guess I could offer like a non-aggression pact or something maybe. Uh, but honestly, we'll just kill him. <laughs> if he comes towards us, uh, we'll just kill him. All right, so with her, how do I target... Because I'm supposed to target a uh, an enemy with uh, like a magic thingy, uh, magic attack. So I want to right click to act, left click to inspect, right click to act. Oh, okay. So we just we just click assault units, uh, and she inflicts the damage. Okay, interesting. Um, your success chance is the total of the action's base chance and any effects that your hero or the target possesses. Base chance, 50%. Your hero's effects plus 5. Target's effects plus 0%. So it's a 55% chance of a positive outcome. I mean, we gotta try, right? Strike at their <laughs> heart. Oh, she went by herself. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Madam, <laughs> get back here. <laughs> All right, well, the trial was at least a, uh... Oh, no, it was a failure. Uh, oh, boy. But we unlocked the ice guards. <laughs> Hooray. Frost, oh, boy. Okay, madam, you... March. I did not know she was going to go on her own. I thought that we were all going to go together. It was going to be a family. Die, uh... Frozen barbs. Oh, I really, really this wish that I could get, like, just a little bit closer to her, but I can't. Oh, boy. This could be very bad. <laughs> Let's find out. Let's find out. Mercy. Fregness. What, what good names. I love these names. Performed Hinder Replenishment against Yuri Barkov. Uh, okay, Grawl is... Oh, he's, he's running. Grawl don't want this smoke. <laughs> uh, income from all buildings, plus 5%. Hell yeah. Love that. Um, oh, we're not currently researching any technologies. What? What? Uh, growth. Let's, let's get some growth going here. Um, okay. Right. Uh, Zoria? You get back here, Missy. You get right back here. Um, 
And I mean, we're going to. Yeah. I mean, we're we're, we're gonna. I only serve the wolf father. Uh, can we not just straight up attack this dude? None can stand before me. Okay. Yuri. I guess I guess we're. Uh. Oh. I mean. Yeah, they declared war on us. Screw it. Let's go. Elected to declare war on the Kvelligs. No allies have chosen to become involved in this dispute. No. Okay. Ready weapons That's fine. <laughs> uh, no equipment available. Uh, decisive victory is how it's supposed to go. So... Uh, I mean, I, th I feel like, uh, hmm. I kind of just want to auto-resolve this one, uh, but it is, because it's such a small, like, encampment, uh, I kind of want to auto-resolve this one so we can move on. That's really the, yeah, all right, that's fine. Um. <laughs> uh I I want to I want to do a larger battle uh with my like actually doing it uh myself. Um all right, so very cool. Uh Yuri, we cannot be everywhere. What if we ooh, trust a veteran neat. to lead a new army? One to help enforce your will, bring forward those who wish to lead. Let me see. I mean, I am down with that. Let's go. Okay. Lord Recruitment. Yes. Uh, go to the Lord Recruitment panel and choose who will serve. Note any traits they have and the cost to recruit them. Okay. We have Peter Yakushkin and Chagin Ulrikov. That's <laughs> probably not how you pronounce any of those. Uh, but we're, we're, we're trying. All right. Uh, they're equal to, like, as far as recruiting, they're, they're equal to... Um, Equal cost and upkeep. Uh, I like Peter's name, and also he's a strongholder, so uh, I think that he'll he will hold the uh, hold the line. Oh, yeah. Recruit a second lord. Yeah. When you recruit a lord, they begin without an army. You transfer units from one lord and give them to another. To do this, move your new lord beside an existing one on the campaign map. Then select one and right-click on the other. This will open the unit exchange panel. Okay, so we, we move one lord next to the other. Uh, which they're, they've already done. Take me there. All right, so... Where's, where's Peter? Ah, the flags are in the way. All right, so that, there's Yuri. I said right click. Uh, I guess we can't. Uh... A bold oh, yeah. Strategist. Hmm. Your death will be an afterthought. Okay. Let's let's do this. I. Let's let's try this again. Okay. Because I, I barely understood what they freaking meant. So we can't move uh, Yuri. But we can move Peter. We need to move him. Like, uh, we need to move him here. But this is just going to... Oh, right click to exchange units. Okay, here we go. Ah, okay, so I did just need to uh, right click. I thought that was going to make him join the the army, but you we already have 20 units, so we can't do that anyway. Uh, okay. So we want uh, horsemen. Two of... Uh, let's... Uh, there we go. Two, uh, one that needs a little help and one that's full strength. Uh, actually, let's put three Streltsy in there. Uh, let's keep the Kossars, uh, but let's put two armored Kossar units and... Uh, right now, that's all I'm going to give him. Because then I'm going to recruit uh, some more. 
Uh, but I think hopefully that will uh, no uh, save you. that will do him for now. Uh, unassigned skill points. Here we go. Uh, we have one skill point for Yuri, uh, and I think we're going to hmm, deadly blade melee attack plus three, indomitable leadership plus four. Uh, both of those could be quite good, but I think we're going to do a recruitment cost minus 10%. Let me get those Yay. recruitment costs down. Uh, all right, Tor's battle him. Uh, icon of strength, uh, weapon strength plus five percent. We cannot unlock healer. That's at rank twenty. Good lord. Uh, replenish troops. Replenishment rate is, accre is increased by an additional three percent. That's what we're going with. And we got one more uh, wound. Ooh, that could be that could be very good. Uh, but I like. Mm. Uh, I don't know. Uh, assault garrison could be could be very good. Yeah, yeah, because we're we are gonna end up sieging things. So I think we we want. Uh, ooh, missile resistance ten percent. Oh, that could be very good. Yeah, yeah. I think that has to be has to be what we choose, right? Uh, missile resistance is going to be. Clutch. Um, and we are researching our technology. You are uh, not a okay. Building upgrade available in the frozen plains. Uh, so this is our our main hall for Fort Dervingard. Um, it costs six thousand to do, but it's plus five leadership to all armies. I don't think we can afford to do that just yet. Uh, oh, and this is our, our main building anyway. Um, so we're not really worrying about that. What is, what can we do here? Uh, infrastructure. Infrastructure. Uh, income generated, uh, is another 104 per turn for a thousand. Let's do that. Yeah. Just don't have the the funds available right now to do much more. Uh, for Ice Canyon, that would bump us up another 300 per turn, but it costs 3,500 to construct. I don't think we're going to do that. Yep. Yeah. All right, Fregnus, what you got? <laughs> Formed hinder replenishment. Ugh. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Okay, again, a decisive victory. Still a pretty pretty small army. Uh what do I want? Well, the settlement garrison will all die if I do that. Well, what is control large army? Uh, allows you to take up to 40 units on the battlefield at once without waiting for reinforcements. Okay. I mean, it's low casualties. So... Yeah, it doesn't matter what I click, really. It's it's gonna... Uh, but this also gives us, like, three different armies, or three different sets of units that uh, are available to us to try to uh, coordinate but I don't know yeah I don't I don't think I don't think I'm gonna fight it I'm gonna, I'm gonna let the decisive victory go through and my we will uh, yeah we'll let it go for now okay got a new rank um, we have no time to call uh, we can execute indenture or treasury uh, I'm going to indenture uh, because that will replenish our army by 10% they will serve. ooh 
Level 10 Lord. Yeah. Uh, we gained a Knight's Ward. Very cool. And an Opal Amulet. Granted, it's where uh, a life-saving second chance but suffers a hairline fracture in its previously perfect surface as a result. Melee Defense plus 4. Ability Opal Amulet. Uh, Granted, it's where... Okay. Duration 22 seconds. Cooldown 60 seconds. Okay. Neat. Uh, trait gained Chaos Breaker. Today, the blight of chaos and corruption on our land has been washed clean. Uh, leadership plus five when going against warriors of chaos, demons of chaos, and Norshka. Nice. Uh, faction destroyed. Oh, wow. We obliterated them. Okay. Nothing left apart from the echoing laughter of thirsting gods. Hell yeah. Uh, and we are now level 10. Uh, Primarch Sergei Yakov is level 4. Zorga is level 8. Uh, Peter is level 2. Uh, and uh, Zorga now has a horse. That's awesome. Uh, and we completed construction on our storehouse. So, all around, uh, pretty, pretty good, pretty good outcome, I would say. <laughs> uh, but, I mean... We got more, right? Uh, we, we have some unassigned sk skill points, first of all. Uh, so let's do that. Um, I think upkeep minus 3%. Let's do that. Um, for Sergei, uh, I like him to do... Uh, I really wish I could do healer, um, but I can't. Uh, impassioned, melee defense. Uh, so that unlocks minus 100% vigor per second. Oh, oh, oh. So, oh, I understand. I understand. It, it basically makes them uh, more or less tired. <laughs> it seems it seems like that's what that means um, but I think I'm going to go with hinder replenishment for him uh, so that we can uh, hit the enemy is where it hurts right in their replenishment uh, let's bring in face my justice let's bring in a oh, war bear so cool it's gonna be very cool when it happens uh, I want to get evasion uh, for her uh, because I think that that will be clutch speed plus five melee defense plus five uh, it's, and it's passive ability so I really want to get that so let's just get death frost another bump up and then for Peter uh, route marcher could be very good but melee defense plus five you are less than nothing Oh, wait. Unit experience gain per turn plus 75. And our uh, aura leadership effect is plus 5. Yeah, okay. Yeah, get more experience. Uh, that will be very good. Very good. Uh, okay, so now let's look at our objectives. We still have uh, to get a uh, settlement to tier 5. We're working on that. Raid. Um, Battle for the Brazen Altar is right over here. Okay, we can get that done soon. Let's take a look at this, actually. Uh, okay, it just does. It doesn't say um, anything about like what it actually is. Uh, okay, I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna finish clearing these guys out, and then, uh, the yeah, and then I think we're going to have to end this video. Uh, uh, so. So I did not know that this prologue was going to take this long. Uh, I had no clue. Uh, I'm really enjoying it, though. I hope you guys are, too. Uh, and, uh, yeah, I think I might, like, s no, I'm not going to simultaneously start another campaign. Uh, that That's, that's going to be too much. Uh, but I will try to blast through the rest of this prologue uh, and get to the main game. Uh, but like, I'm, I'm not going to, like, just speed through it <laughs> uh i'm gonna i'm gonna have some fun with it all right yuri uh let's recruit Grow some units my army. 
<laughs> units. Uh, I want... I want my ice swords. A uh, hybrid unit. Uh, Anti-infantry. They're bow and dual sword. And they are anti-infantry and they have frostbite. Uh, so I'm pretty excited about these guys. Uh, I can only recruit one uh, at a time. Uh, but that's okay. All right. So now I currently have two Streltsy. Uh, let's get... Let's get another one. Um, and then... Yeah, I think that'll have to do for Yuri uh, and his army for now. Uh, so let's go... Let's go... Can I fight this guy? Oh, dang it. Servant only of the murder god! <laughs> what just happened? Oh, that was Peter. Not, uh... Okay. So, I think I'm gonna have Peter, uh... Hmm. I think I might actually, like, start bringing him down through here. Uh... Or, no. No, I should keep him with, uh... Roll out! with Yuri. Uh yeah. Yeah, we're going to we're going to stay we're going to all stay together. Uh so this is main settlement chain building. Okay. So I have to I have to upgrade the the province capital or the the the, the yeah, province capital uh building first the Kislev outpost building uh into a fort to get that achievement. What are my... You need four population surplus to order this construction. So... So I need... Ooh, man. Okay, so I have, I have a lot that I need to uh, to get done. So let's go ahead and let's get a new some more money uh, going. And I guess... Whatever we can do to build up our population as well... Uh, we will, we will do to get one of these uh, settlements upgraded to a uh, um, fifth level. Okay. Uh, this is a thousand. It'll give us plus thirty growth. Oh, and we're already at uh, three there. Okay. Okay. I like that. We can do that. Um, yeah. Very cool. Okay. Now, Yuri, can we attack these dudes? I don't think we can. Such ignorance. No, I don't think we can. I don't know why. Like they're they're right there. I I, I just wanna I wanna smack you. <laughs> why can't I smack you? I just wanna punch you punch you in your little face. But that's okay. It's fine. Uh, Yuri is gonna go this direction, and Peter will be garrisoned is red here. With blood. And more must be shed until we reach the brazen altar. Our comrades fear this land. Doubt that sucks for them. Us. We fight those who worship blood and fire. Match their rage with our own. Thief, or trial of the murder. Also, I said thief. Eliminate a lord belonging to the following faction in battle, the Blood Keepers. A toll must be paid to pass through Korn's realm. Become a killer to pass through the bloody lands. I mean, I've already done that. If Kislev does not care, why should I? Uh, but... Yeah, I guess uh, we're just going to chill out back here. Uh, 
Okay. This will bump us up to three, another 315. Can, uh, just, we can't afford to do it yet. I don't want to do it yet. I, yeah, I kind of want to see what these guys are doing. So they're they're running, or are they are they coming to attack me? No. I was gonna say that would be kind of dumb, buddy. Uh, okay, Pregnus, bro, you um, you done, done some dumb stuff. Zoria has been wounded and must take time to recover. Oh, oh. It bothers me. Spreading the word, growth plus 10, let's go. New technology. Um, let's go with... Um, Lord Recruit rank plus one. Could be good. Weapon strength. Let's do it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, do, 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 do. I still don't really understand why I can't attack these guys. Hold your lies, work tongs. Exhaustion. Okay. So Yuri. Hmm. Where is oh here okay, here's this guy. So Sergei. Oh, okay. So Sergei can target them, can target Fregnus. I only serve the wolf father. Uh Sergei. Uh can wound. Ugh. So only a 30% chance. That's that's gross. So what about Mercy here. Yeah, let's try it. Uh, critical failure. He got wounded in the attempt. Yeah, that sounds like stuff that happens to me. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> uh, well, I thought that I was just going to be able to, to, to like, kill these guys. But obviously, I cannot for some reason. I don't... I honestly, I don't understand. Maybe someone can explain to me why I can't uh, attack these guys like just flat out and just just take care of them. Um, maybe you can explain it to me. But uh, for now, we're gonna post up right here. Uh, next episode, next video, we're gonna go into this raid. We're already at 43 minutes. I don't want to push it any longer. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and save. Thank you all so much for hanging out with me. I really appreciate it, as always. And uh, I'll catch you in the next one. Bye!